Hi, and thank you for taking a look at this video on the Outer Banks erosion maps. So if you, uh, it, it's actually a state website where you can see this. So if you go down to, and I've got a link under Kitty Hawk. It's, there's a number of places you can find it on my website, but this is probably the easiest one to find. In this second paragraph in the Kitty Hawk town page, you'll see this link to erosion on the Outer Banks. If you click on that, then it will take you to this, um, this state page that gives you access to the state erosion rate maps. There's also some good information in here about development along the coast. Uh, it shows here if a structure is less than 5,000 square feet, it needs to be a minimum of 60 feet from the first line of vegetation or 30 times the setback factor. Uh, there's a lot of rules with regards to that, and uh, if you would like to talk about it some, feel free to call me, uh, call Scott Team Realty, we're, we'll be able to give you some help, or uh, you can also call an engineer, they can give you that information. So, to get the erosion rate map, you click on this interactive map viewer, and you'll see here the whole state of North Carolina. And what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down to Nags Head real quick. And here we are uh, in Nags Head, just north of the Nags Head Pier, which is right here. And then you'll want to go over to uh, this button over here on the left-hand side, the layer list. And you have setback factors, uh, erosion rates from different years. You can see that they did do them about... Oh, I don't know, every seven or eight years, something like that. Uh, and then, so if you click on Erosion Rates 2020, this will show you the erosion rate in this particular area that they found in 2020. Uh, you can see here, just north of the Nags Head Pier, it's a negative 1.3 feet each year, the erosion is. Um, it's interesting, you can go to different parts of the county and find different rates. You can see down here at Oregon Inlet, they're, they're much higher. Uh, and then south of Oregon Inlet, in Salvo, actually, there is there, the beach is growing. You can see down here, it's uh, up to five feet a year where it's growing. This is um, on Pea Island, looks like, this particular spot. And then further south in Salvo, there's also some growth of the beach. Not as much. So that's really it for this uh, video. Uh, if we can help you with anything here on the Outer Banks, please feel free to call Scott Team Realty. We're happy to help you. Thank you.